Why? Okay. <laughs> Let me set you up. Okay. Gotta tell mama, say, Mama, go get on the live. No, I just told her they were going live. live. We're gonna give everyone a minute to come in here and then we're gonna tell them what we're doing. I'm gonna check her. Yes, sir. Okay, go for it. Give everyone a minute. They're probably not used to our channel. So we haven't been on here in forever. Or daddy did it wrong. Oh, no, Paula's here. So I didn't do it wrong. Say, hey, Paula. What did you do wrong? No, I said, oh. I was telling Emma, I was like, I don't know if I did this right. So I ain't done it in forever. It's been actually about two months. Hey, Kyle. Hi. And Lori. Hi. Hey, hey, hey. Hello. Paula said, hey, best friend, Emma. You want to show, show her your cool hair? Hey, Richard. <laughs> she loves them. her hair clips. Hey, them. Mama. Let me show them Jackson real quick. Y'all see Jackson? That's all he wants to do is play on them drums. Yeah? And Paula said, oh, pretty. Okay, Jackson. something about your phone not working, Jess. So, we're going to... We need everyone a minute or so to come in, then we're going to start doing this. Hey, Beta. She said, hey, Emma Lou, or beautiful Emma Lou. Um, I'm going to show you guys something pretty cool that, don't be gross, that we did from previous years. Shane talked about in our other video. Emma, ah, ah, ah. Let me take her. Um, Papa's going to grab you. So, from previous years, um we keep a sample of every one this is probably the biggest this is from the first one hey, Aunt show so just to show you the differences and it's i know one of the years we actually extracted two um different times i've had a said hey shane this one's still liquid so the one cool thing we found out through beekeeping is um depending on the the oh that one's still liquid i want to say this is more buckwheat uh, the that's when we planted all that buckwheat Wee! in the pasture. Yeah, that but whole pasture full of buckwheat and sunflower. It turned out real dark looking like that, like molasses. Yeah, still good though. But um, depending on what kind of uh, pollen you have, and that's two years ago. It'll crystallize faster, like cotton honey will crystallize real fast, is what they say. Um, so yeah, and we try to save cool. a batch from every every time we harvest. We try to save one one little sample jar just. Just for fun. It was Travis's idea. I thought that was kind of cool. Yeah. Hey, Tiff. Aunt Tiffany's here. Do you want to say hey? And she said, uh, Emma hey. and Jackson is such a cutie, and Mr. Mason hey. helped with the honey process. He loves helping. What's up, May? Oh, it's on the honey. Which one do you want to try? That one first. So the, the one from our very first year? Yeah. And us, and see, look, that is solid. Can you uh, get any? Come here, give me a shit. You want a little bit? What do you guys think? I should pick them up. God, what is this? All right, that one's from two years ago. I don't know why, but I wanted to. Oh, live wire. Made me instantly think of lime wire. Shows my age. You want a little bit? Or I want to say there was a another YouTuber that did. Um, his name was Live Wire. He did parkour. Try I'd be insane if that was you, but doubt it. What week was this? Well, honey, you gave me the first time. That's amazing, by the way. You did it here and watch. I want to say that's from my first year. That's the buckwheat, honey. I should lower this down so everyone can see the kids. Hold on. I'm going to lower this down. I'm going to actually Yummy. have to eat. Yummy, Daddy. What's up, Emma? Yummy. I, I know. Now try that one. I can get that one open. I'm glad you loved it. I can't wait to have more. That's a lot. Sorry to keep you awake. Emma, they can't see you too well. Ooh, they're over there trying honey. You wanna go get some honey? Ooh, you wanna go get some? Go get some. So right now, I guess it's more of a... Go get some honey. Go get some honey. Can I move your phone closer to the window, maybe? Oh. Go get some honey. Unfortunately, we're doing this in the basement. I can try moving it in one second. Mm. This is the last one, kiddos. Jackson's behind. Okay, go Jackson. <laughs> <It's like digging laughs> Let's go for the scoop. Let me see about moving this. Hold on. Hold me. 
I need to move my phone because these signals weak, I guess. I oh, wait. It's sunny. It's better now? It's because I'm staying close to it. Don't get it. Mason, what does it taste like? Live wire well, wants to know. Lord, I'm seeing those signals in there. there you go. <laughs> Which one was your favorite? Boy, what are you making this at? This, this one. Okay, so that one. So the first year, Mason liked it. I don't know why. Yeah. A little bit more? No, I want bunch. No bunch. Hey, Jesus is Lord. I like it dark on man. That's good stuff. So, I don't that's, know, that's, I don't know who's right come over from Shane's live. We just checked the beat. Well, kind of checked them. Um, yeah, go back and watch that live when it gets done processing. Yeah, and uh, we... We're gonna extract honey from that because we had swarms and all that firewood and or fireweed in Georgia. Maybe I'm sure. What's the one that everyone loves? Tupelo, the wood. Yeah. Uh, sourwood is always supposed to be the most high end type honey. It's sourwood honey. I love that. I love all honey though. I love all. I love orange blossom. I love all of them. Dad's best. That sister. was your favorite honey. That was my favorite too. I love Brent, that dark. Honey. I'm not That's sure where live wire is going with that. I'm sorry. Hey, hey, Brenda. Brenda Baker. All right. So now I want to show you guys what we're doing. I'm also not doing it with a hot knife tonight or today because Jack's running around and I just don't really like doing it. And there's only a few frames. It's not too bad doing it with a cold knife. Um, you just got to do more of a sawing motion. You're just trying to get through um, the things. Oh, it's Amy. Okay. Oh. That's um, Rikers or Skies. I can't remember which one. I'm sorry. I'm out of it. All right, let's, let's, but, let's put all this back and get this out of the way. Okay. Oh, yeah, Jack's got the cutie curls. Yeah, he's I, do you want to pull up Papa's lunchbox so you can stand on it? Okay, go grab it. It's right there. So this is for all Rikers. Okay. Um, yes, and thank you, Paula, for linking to that. This is to get the ones that are too shallow. And then this, there's we have two different ones. This is the cold one. You just saw through, and it cuts. And with the hot one, you can kind of just melt through. It has not posted yet, but it'll be there soon. Okay. I'm overall the family favorite, so we can just get that over. So Aunt Amy's here, Aunt Shell's here, Aunt Tiffany's here. Grandma's not. We need to get on to gra Grandma. Oh, you're Jasmine today. And that's your purse you colored. Aunt Shell said she loves your dress. Aunt Tiffany said, Emma! I don't know if that's enough um, exclamation points. Or, yeah. No, please do not lick me. Uh, Aveta said, hi, Princess Emma. Is your dress inside out? No. Y'all see all her hair bows? Put your head down, look. <laughs> she had to put every hair bow she had in. Ooh, and it looks so pretty. It looks so pretty. All right, hop down, baby girl. Let's get some money. So she should be. Alright, so. Not sure. Has it... Yeah, she never has enough bows. She always needs more. I'm gonna have to turn it in a little bit. Cinderella is also is so puffy. Yeah. She loves her princesses and dressing up. Oh, that's a cut comb. So we're gonna set that aside. This will be our I'm first time doing here. cut comb. Yeah, we didn't actually plan on doing any of this today. So Emma just, she loves looking her best on everything. How yeah, long I does it see take? That, I seen that swarm this afternoon. Emma, please don't jump. Emma, hop down, baby. Hop down, sweetheart. Now, I seen that swarm this afternoon. That was the second one in two days. So I just yeah, we're asked Travis, it. you think we ought to give some of this honey? Because all the bee, most of the bees are left anyway. So let's get in here and get some of this honey. They got all summer to build it back up. So doesn't we don't, take, take, we don't try long. to take a lot. So we're just enough to get us for a year. And it doesn't take too long, maybe 30, 40 minutes ish. I don't know. Yeah, it depends on. And it depends on the box. We only have a one's gonna be cut comb. That's not cut comb, right? No, that's not cut. And we only have one, two, three, four, five. We have five frames. And the box, the spinner will hold four, so it yeah, ain't like on. we got a lot. Yeah, this yeah. will be quick. It'd be nice if we have four or five of these boxes to Yeah, fill. if we got if they're bigger and all that, we could it can take we could do it all a lot longer. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna spin this real quick. Show you guys. Hopefully this is going out far enough. Yeah. So if you had the 
I did the hot knife, but with Jack running around and Mason and Emma, I, yeah, go right through like butter. Yeah, that uh, hot knife, it'll second. melt it. You know, it's wax. Uh, hot, that hot knife just runs right through it. But that's in the and this just as well. Get a close up of that. Let me get a close up of that. Look at that. Ooh, oh yeah. This Emma, has a Emma, yeah. Hop down. You can't get on the table, baby. Hop down. Hop down. I'm not gonna zip on the table. Let's see. I read comments. I ain't got my glasses. And I got a swollen eye. Uh, and you'll comment. I got my words so big. Let's see. I got mine so big. My mom's there. Welcome, Diane. <laughs> oh, Diane no, Wangard. Let's see. I I uh, found my way over here and subscribed. Awesome. Thank you. How long does it take to extract honey from one box? It, it doesn't take that long. It doesn't take this. Uh, this extractor we have. This extractor we have. It'll hold four frames. And, and it's a small one. Yeah, too. and you burn through it pretty quick. You burn through it pretty quick. Now he'll he'll scrape off with a knife, and what the knife won't reach if the comb is deeper. Or shallower than the ed edge of the frame, you'll go through and scratch it because you got to get the caps off because all the honey's underneath the, the and we, cap. We try not to ruin our wax because we put yeah. this back out for the bees to use. And if we, if they don't have to rebuild the wax, it um, saves them a lot of time, energy. Yeah, we're gonna get honey in one minute, baby girl. They want some honey. Let's see. I apologize, guys. Wow, that is golden. Brings back sweet memories. Isn't that nice? I gotta go with my reading glasses. I tell you what, I got a swollen eye where I got stung today, and I don't have my reading glasses. All right. Jessica's happy. I know she loves that honey. Now you gotta make some sausage, Jessica. That Mason's gonna want some sausage and honey. I'll make it. I made some this morning. Yeah. So he just. All right, go upstairs and go. And see, I try to get nine, do nine frames because it'll draw out slightly thick. I don't know if you can quite see it. That, that might have been a 10 framer, but yeah. Jack, are you going to go paint? What you got, buddy? You coming in to paint? <laughs> you going to do some painting for Papa? He's so sweet. Oh, yeah, that was perfect. I want to show them about this, this thing here, too. This thing is awesome. As you're cutting that comb off, you'll lose some honey in these caps right here. These caps right here, I still have some honey, but you leave it in here, and it drains through this screen. It'll drain through this screen down into this bottom box. We have to stand so that it's painted. Down in this bottom box, and there's a valve on the front. So after you get done, you can take all the honey that's that you've lost here and save it. And keep it, yeah. So you're really hardly losing any honey. And we, we reuse these caps, we yeah. melt them down. Yeah, we do. We melt the caps down. We take once the caps, once we got all that honey, gravity will really pull that honey out of those little those little thin stripes, strips of caps. The honey will come out of it. And we'll take them caps, and we, we have a big, I actually have a five gallon bucket right over there. That's about that full. Once we fill it up full of wax, we'll melt it down and uh, strain it, and we'll have some nice, big, solid, pretty br uh, bricks of wax. I'll go grab one in a second and show you all the last time we've done it. It really turns out nice. We'll take that wax, you can make anything with it. Candles, uh, we paint it right back on our frames. If you take an empty frame that doesn't have any comb, you paint it on there, the bees will draw that comb out a lot faster because they have a lot of extra wax to work with. They don't have to create wax. They got a lot of extra that you just gave them. So it really helps out saving everything that you possibly can from these bees. And we don't really use the wax for other than the beekeeping stuff. Um, yeah, sorry if I'm missing comments. But I thought this would be fun to show you guys. And as you guys know, I'm the world's worst at editing in a timely manner. to see me do it live there's the last block of wax that we saved we melted that down and it's just all from caps and stuff like that and from frames that we thought were bad we scraped the wax off and melted all down and strain it through a piece of pa uh, some pantyhose and you got a nice pretty we could probably strain that melt it and strain it one more time to make it even 
cleaner because it's still a little dirty. Shoot, that's a lot of wax. And it's not cheap either when you go to buy it, is it? No. It is not cheap. The honey is coming. This one didn't have anything on it. Kellen says, Uncle Travis, he doesn't believe you're actually alive. I know. I haven't done it forever. Uh, I don't know, Paul said something. Sorry, I can't tell you. Yeah, in one second, Let baby. Do you want the Paul wax said. or what do you want, baby? Let's see. Hold on. Kellen says, Uncle Travis, he doesn't believe you're actually live. I'm here, buddy. We are live in Georgia. Is that the same one from like two or three years ago? That brick? Probably. Maybe it may have been that long. It may have been two years ago, because like I say, we didn't do anything with the bees last year. No, not yet. We gotta spin. Yes. This is actually hey, gonna be really fast. Veda, I'm so sorry. We're thinking of you over here. Let's see. What's going on with the veda? Is she not doing it? So how do you make candles out of wax? Brenda, I couldn't tell you. We've never done it. We've never, I mean, we've from never. what I understand, you just melt it down, run a wick into it. Yeah, run a wick. I've heard it let it dry, and you just keep doing it over and over and over. Yeah. I think we've never we've never done anything with it except yeah, paint it back on the yeah. things. Yeah. Put your chat in live mode. You know how to do that, Travis? Is it in live mode? Who's they talking? I don't Paula told me that one time before. Paula, I don't have a clue what live mode means outside of what we're doing now. We're showing that we're live. I don't know. Oh, because you're scrolling back up. Huh? I'm guessing because you scrolled back up. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm over here going up and down with the comments. He smiled. They're live. It's not pretend yet. Yeah, I'm trying to go back and just see if we missed any comments. I've been scrolling up and down with comments. Oh, you want to see the camera, baby girl? Oh, Jack. That's a good one. <laughs> she just wants to see her, don't she? Let me see. Let Move your hand. Let me see it. Move your hands. She knows move your hands. she's a princess. Look down. Look down. They want to see your lollipop. Look down. Look down here. Look down here. Come here, bows. There you go. <laughs> they want to see your lollipop. Yeah, we'll be done in a second as far as the cutting part goes. We'll be done in a second. Well, let's see here. Paula says, that is so cute. What? Hi, Cinderella. Jesus is Lord said, hey, Cinderella. Because I got to get all four cuts. Say, hey. Hey, but they shine me. It's, but it's Jasmine. Oh, that's Jasmine. That's not Cinderella. Jesus is Lord. Come on. You know that's Jasmine. <laughs> is that Jasmine? Yeah. What's Jasmine on? Blue. I mean, no, what, what, what show was she, she on? What was she movie was she from? What movie was she from? Shrek? What movie is Jasmine? <laughs> Do you remember? Oh, I can't remember. You can't remember, huh? What was that snow movie, that ice movie, what's it called? Frozen. Frozen. What's the girls in Frozen called? So this one, unfortunately, is not drawn out enough. On and Elsa, you remember today? Yeah, one second. You want to chew on some? Yes. Show them, show them on, yeah, show them on the camera. And say, that's a good one. I got it all over me. Yeah, show them on the camera. Mmm, you gotta spit that out. Let's spit that right here. I mean, you don't want to do it? You don't want to do it? Look, it's like chewing gum. I do not want mm. You just want straight honey? I just want to What honey. are you doing? Okay, so I am, so right here the knife did not cut, so I'm opening up all the caps so that when we spin it, it can open out. Um, yeah, so it'll spin out. Let me show you. This cord is going to drive me insane. Uh, sorry, my, I did not charge my phone today. And Could I pull it in? What it is, in the box. is when you set my that knife on here, that knife will touch right. each side of this frame. And so you just slide down the wood is what you're doing. You just slide down the wood. So everything that's grown out or that's drawn out, uh, you'll cut. What's, if it's not drawn out all the way, the knife can't cut it. So you have to go in and sort of scrape it. That's actually a, a scraper that you can buy. Get out of there, boy. That's all right. It's working. It's working. I'm just trying to open it up. Can I have some bar? Yeah, grab the one. That, can you open it? Or? <laughs> I have this one. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Go ahead, Rick. My eye itches. You got honey. You'll need here, one of those rollers to uncap. Yeah, we could do that. I mean, mm. but we got. Like, you got popcorn out of this side. Do I know? Okay, you're gonna help spin it, okay? Can, can I do this part? 
You and Emma will take turns. What about I have 500 minutes? Uh, hopefully we're not doing this for 500 minutes. 500 minutes, 500 minutes? Okay. Yep. So one thing I'll show you guys that we also do is we keep a little bucket of water because you get honey all over yourself. Yeah, you always get honey on this. We learned to keep a bucket of water down here. Not that it's dirty, it's just sticky. Can you use a pancake flipper? Maybe. I mean, it'd be kind of flat and not... You need kind of yeah, you something, something that's, sharp. Yeah, it's a little tough to get off. You don't, yeah, you need it. A sharp edge. That, you don't want to scrape all the comb out neither because we try to put these, once we get the honey out extracted, we try to put them right back on the hive. The bees will actually clean out what's left, make them nice clean comb again, and they'll turn around and reuse them. Okay, so we're going to show you the spinning part. You better hold on. Yeah, I was going to get it first, Mason. Now, this is the part where it gets a little crazy. Go so ahead, my spin, spin, spin. Well, I got to keep, you got to keep it pressed in, baby girl. See, it's not working. Here, look, I'm going to show you. Press. So when you're doing it, you can do it with your hand. You don't have to put your hand there. I just, see, push in. There you go. Keep angle. There you go. <laughs> you want to do the button part? Okay, spin, 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 spin. Come on. Let me get some more momentum out of there, girl. All right, Mason's turn. Come here, bud. Good job, Emma. Thank you, honey. You got it. We're going to get some honey. Come on, you know how you got No, you're not spinning nothing. No. Oh. Okay. Right there, now spin. Good. There you go. All right, let me take a turn. Hold your hand on top of that green piece. Oh, yeah. In the center. Mm. Y'all stand back so that they don't hit y'all in the head. Yeah, hey, one second. I'm trying to get it knocked out, buddy. Behind the camera. Ah, you can hear me. <laughs> hey, Don. You can hear me eating, eating honey. Yeah, I love this wax. Now I eat it up. Oh, Kaleidoscope Junkie, I think, is in here. Yeah. Uh, yeah sorry, we're not checking comments. Oh, hey, Kaleidoscope Junkie. Yeah, we're not checking comments like we should. We will. Yes, our honey has been running low. <laughs> How much sugar did Mason have before this video? How much sugar have you That's had? That's every day. I love it. <laughs> Willis, yeah, he's on my subscribe, yeah. He's trying to turn me on to Sheraton Farms. And oh, all. yeah, the, he's... The, the uh, pig guy. Yeah, yeah. That guy's awesome. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah, Mason, you want some more, more honey? I'm going to turn him around, actually, and spin it the back real quick. Mason, you want some more of this honey cap? You want some, Emma Lou? Take a big bite. Mason. Yeah. Take a big bite of that. Yeah. <laughs> that is a lot. Ooh, that's good. You see, we get all this scat honey. Y'all see that? Mmm. Mmm. That's the best part. Isn't it, mate? That's some good honey. That is the best part. Look at that. Mmm. Y'all see that? Where's that camera at? Mmm. 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 Crap. So mm. now. <laughs> Oh, you want some, baby girl? Here. You gotta flip them over. My cameraman's angling it all the wrong way. Hey, baby. You gotta flip it over so it can get out of the other side. Just chew all the honey out, and then we we'll spit the wax out. Okay. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. Hey, spit the wax out right here, buddy. Hey, spit the wax out on the table. Pretty cool, cause look, it takes it all out of one side. Mm -hmm. I don't know. That's how I'm gonna turn that over, man. Just turn it over and do the other side. Oh, oh my. <laughs> I'm trying to get a piece. 
Here, here, wipe your arm off. Put it right there, baby. Get my hands all sticky. Okay, stop it, Shane. That's not fair. Mm-mm-mm. Y'all need to get you some bees. Or find a beekeeper that yeah. will probably not let you extract with them. <laughs> like I say, guys, y'all know me. I'm, I don't fool with bees all that much, but I take full advantage of them when it's honey time, that's for sure. Jackson, what do you got in your mouth, boy? Well, yeah. Hopefully this has been pretty fun for you guys to see this. It's different. And it brings me back out. Was I get <coughs> this is called a good dad. And thank you, Tiff, and I think Paula said it back. Said what? Said I'm a great grandpa? No, one of us is a great <laughs> Let's see. I know he did. He's amazing. Let's see. He's a great dad for sure. Yes, he is. I am so y'all talking about Travis. I am so glad. He married my daughter. That's because I raised him. <laughs> How often oh. can you harvest in one season? Lila, we only harvest uh, two to three times. Well, well yeah. we only harvest once. Yeah, we only harvest true. once because we're afraid we're going to starve our bees out. It, the bees actually make honey for their food storage. It's the way that they store food for the winter. So they work all spring and summer, save food for the winter. We go and rob it out. We take it from them. They don't make it for us. You take it and you hope that you left them enough uh, to Watch get them through the winter. Because if you don't, they'll starve out. They'll starve yourself to death and you'll have a dead, uh, dead hive. And, so it's perfect time right now to get it because they still have all spring and summer to build that honey back up. And it depends on the year. Certain yeah. years they produce more. Yeah. And I also am very anti-feeding them to get them through the winter. Yeah, sugar water. A lot of people feed sugar water. Yeah, I'm very anti-sugar water because, like, right now we know this is straight honey. These bees have not had sugar water at all. Um, so I sacrifice on not getting as much honey, but I also don't have to do as much work on it. Suck, suck all that honey out of there. Get all that honey out of there. Ooh. You want some, Hey. What? Mason, I'm going to be sure to brush your teeth. Yeah, they definitely will have to. They love their honey. Fun thing, the first bee class we went to, Miss Jessica and I, uh, she was pregnant with Mason over here. And uh, it's just me wanting to get into them. I figured I'd start learning. And then we used to go to a bee club. And then life happened and it just doesn't happen. Mm -hmm. Yes, thumbs up. Thumbs up. Emma, you are adorable. You want some more? Mm. Here's a big old chunk. You ready? So, <laughs> does it make? <laughs> yes. If you feed it, well, if you get them sugar, if you get sugar honey, it'll be not real honey, so it'll taste slightly different. Yeah, it won't have the pollen and all that stuff that's supposed to have in it from flowers. Yeah. So, it'll just be sugar. And it'll be weaker before. Uh, thank you. I'm not saying it's right or wrong. You 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 can give them sugar water to get them through the summer winter. or through the winter. But we just I'm like, very anti. Yeah, that was where me and Travis sort of we wouldn't butt heads, but I just I would put tons of sugar water out here to make sure they had food through the winter. And of course, Ooh. come this time of year when you get ready to harvest, you're not sure if you're, you're harvesting sugar water or if you're harvesting actual pollinated honey mm -hmm. so it's just best to, to cut it all out and uh and i mean a lot of beekeepers do it yeah a lot of beekeepers do it keep their bees alive especially if you're invested if you're invested lots of money and lots of bees you want to keep your bees alive so this is our only deep so with doing we should have two deeps but i'm going to leave the two mediums in there because you want the uh spinner yeah, yeah, weighted yeah Roughly the same. I might have to actually put just an empty deep in there. We'll see. So unfortunately, we only have one deep to do. I'm sugared up, man. How about you? Yeah. I'm sugared up. <laughs> I'm sugared up. Yeah. The darker is older. Well, the wax, it's older wax. That's newer wax. So they just keep building on, building on it. Are you drumming, Jackie? 
I'm sugared up. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm sugared up. You sugared up too? <laughs> this is the best part, right? This is what everyone wants to be keeping. Well, we still got to go feed our chickens. You going to let me feed the chickens? Yeah. Yeah. But some birds can act with it stuck in your teeth. Yeah, the wax gets stuck in your teeth, don't it? Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's, that's okay. Wax. It makes your teeth healthy. <laughs> that wax got stuck in my teeth. Yeah. Let's see. I'll read some comments while you speak. Let's see. I'm talking about today. Hey there, Kim from Lila. Hey. Use Laura said, hey, Paul. Oh, I'm so cute. Emma, there's a toothbrush. Emma, there's a toothbrush with that. Ah, oh, Mason is licking his arm. <laughs> yeah, they get it all over him. I love it. I just let them go at it. Who cares? Yeah, I need a beat. I let them jokers go at it. You can't hold it? No, I think I need a D. Oh, oh, oh. All right, so we're going to see how this goes. Jack, watch out, watch out, watch out, buddy. Yeah, it's need a, it needs a counterbalance on it. No, we need a D on the that. other side, but it'll, yeah. it'll work. Yeah, we'll give it that. Oh, oh, careful, one. Well, I'm sorry. You're swinging a lot of weight. Watch this. Oh, I'm sorry. Look at this. Nothing up back. You got that right. Oh, what are you doing, Anna Joy? Are you having a good time, buddy? Put it down, please. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get sugared up. Ain't that right, buddy? And nothing a little water can't fix. And <laughs> that is absolutely hilarious. You're good, buddy. Now, what are you getting? You're going to get the water? shakes in a little bit. You're going to have the shakes. Well, I got to watch you like a hog. Yeah. Uh -uh, uh -uh. <laughs> I thought you said no. Boy, don't mess with none of that. And I can't put things high enough for Jackson. Why well, no, That's our problem at our house. Can't is there? Here, play Papa's drum. Where's in? He's putting it on the table. I'm still chewing on mine. Go play Papa's drums. Good job. Uh -oh. Get it started. Yeah, we got a pile of it on the table. That's a good man. There's a lot on there. It's up to the. It's getting up there. So, another fun story. The first time we ever extracted honey, oh, we yeah. just kept spinning it and spinning <laughs> it. And eventually, it just kind of like stopped. It was so full of honey. Yeah, you should eat a spoonful of honey. But yeah, and we're like, oh, we better extract it. And so, we opened up the valve, and we'll show you that in a second. It just. Yeah, we had the whole barrel full of honey. We we wasn't realizing that we couldn't spin it no more because it was so full of honey. Jess, it's not that far. You can come get it. Michelle is a little dry. Uh, Michelle said she wants a spoonful of honey. What, Jess will want some honey too? Yeah. Come down here and get some, huh, baby. We over here eating all these caps. These caps are good. Tell Mama to come down here. Tell Kim to come down here, both of them. <coughs> this honey's good. It's really good. So it takes about 30 minutes, I guess. So yeah, that's the last. Frames. I mean, we went a little slower. That's the last frame outside of the one oh, we, we got, got to do cut. The cut comb too. Yeah, I got the cut comb, but we've never done the cut comb before, so this will be a first for us. We're going to cut it and put a bunch of them in. I want to put them in the jars. You know how you see a jar full of a comb, full of honey? I think that'd be a lot of fun. <coughs> I think that'd be a lot of fun. Where's the? Yeah, I think that'd be a lot of fun. I, I've, I've always wanted to do that. I'm curious how much we got. Not too bad. We may have, we may have ten pounds, maybe. A lot less than what you, you always get less than what you think you get. Not, not too awful bad. It's right to the not as much as I'd like to have, but we lost all those bees. We just thought it'd be the perfect time. We had two swarms. We had a swarm yesterday and a swarm today. I was the exact same hive, and I just thought, hey, we got all that. We don't have as many bees. Let's go ahead and get what honey we got. Get that out, and then they can build it back. They got all summer to build back up. So I, I doubt we'll get any more. I doubt we'll get any more honey before the year's out. And Travis's words are so small. I just bought a big jar of firewood honey. I've never heard of that. Oh, fireweed honey. Is that what they said? Fireweed honey? And some honeycomb at the Pike Place Market. Okay. That'd be fun. I love that stuff. I, I love, I love it. My name on. So these are 
two jars we use. Yeah. Right, We're going to see how much we get. Kyle says, yes, just can show that beautiful face of yours. Oh, I bet it does. I said, Kyle. Well, your words are smoke. I got to get my glasses. Let's see. Hey, I'll bring we ran out. Oh, thank you. Well, I, I, we ran out of trash. I was just having it. We were completely out. So this I is didn't get to distribute good. it. Yeah, this is going to be good. We, we were good. so bad about selling it and all that, and I feel bad. I've always said, now, now, we, now we're having buy honey again. I hate that. I knew that dog chewed up one of my glasses. Yeah, let me go find I know where it's at. I got more honey. Where's my honey? Everyone wants one of these jars. They're awesome. We'll see how many we got. I'm gonna show you guys real quick. So, see next all full. The honey done cooking. Well, it's done spinning. Let's see. Drop it down. All right. Who cleans this stuff? Uh, the bees will actually help clean up some of it. We put it out there, and then a day or so later, we go out there and um, wash it. Yeah, pure liquid gold. Yeah, I'm working. You're working. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not tapping the button. I know. I can, I can tell you're not, because I can feel it not spinning on me. Oh. Grab them off the table and shoot them up. Yeah, me and Mom are watching you reading the comments. She said, no, she said, you look like you're looking up your nose. If you go down there, go take him a gun. I don't know if it's quite as much as we're hoping, but. No, I looked in there a minute ago, too. But it's a lot. You need to go get a scraper. Where are you going to put my whole thing in there? On my whole table. Uh, Ibetta, your Aunt Tiffany said hey to you. I got this. Mommy. I've shown that off, and that's all I'm at. She's too into eating honey. Oh, sorry. Yeah, there's a screen right there. Screen on top right there. We screen it twice. Oh. We'll end up screening it twice. We screen it once it just to make sure it's super clean. We'll That's run it through one more time. Daddy? <laughs> Kim knocked him in the mind. No, the bee said, yes, sir. Can I try it again, please? Yeah, you can get a little bit. Uh, what was I going to say? Are you talking about my eye? Yeah. Yeah, no, I got stung in the eye today. Yeah, with yeah. bees. It's looking better. Brenda, uh, go to a beekeeping class. It's definitely um, a fun way to get into it. Oh, yeah. And it's cheap, too. We pay $20 a year. Mm -hmm. To go to class. our class. Yeah, to go to class. It's like 20 bucks a year. Look, uh, check your extension office and ask them if they know where any bee class are. We do now. Nowadays, there's the internet. You Google it. And look on Facebook. Because then, then you can get some hands-on awesome. hands yeah. experience. Yeah, and then... I've even said before, you learn more in the parking lot than you do in class because everybody wants to brag about their bees and brag about what's going on. And, and they'll answer, people, <laughs> they love to boast and brag about what they're doing. So you can ask a question in the parking lot and they will, you'll get, a, oh, so much information. You just, we'd spend an hour out in the parking lot, wouldn't we? Oh yeah. yeah. The other thing though we fun. learned quick is Every beekeeper has his own way of doing it, yeah. or her way, I guess. Yeah, well, let's look at me and Travis. Mm -hmm. I mean, we, we both do it totally different, and he swears by his way, I swear by mine, and I figured I'd done with him pretty much. I just let Travis, he loves him. He loves him way more than I do, so I just let him take him. I'm going to do it all his way. Yep. We're getting honey, so. And we didn't buy bees last year. Again, yeah, we well, bought them last year, yeah, kind of bought them this year. year. Yeah. And had I been in them more, we probably could have better this year, but... If we had our bee boxes set up better, too. We got a yeah. bunch of junk in our bee boxes. We need to go through and clean them out. It's, just it's not dying. We don't have a lot of yeah. time. Yep. Jackson, uh, I don't know. He's just been Jackson, running around crazy. one little taste, and he didn't act like he cared for it all that much. Yes, Any other fun beekeeping that. questions? What's y'all's prediction? Yeah, how much honey we got? And I have to let you guys know, because I'm not going to bother it all up on the live. So that's a lot of work. You want me to close it so we can restrain it through? Yeah, we'll do that. Let's do that. Do y'all plant certain flowers to draw them in? We used we, to. Yeah, we have um, three jars. We should definitely have more than that. When I when I, before I planted all the muscadines, you can go back <laughs> probably two or three years ago in my video, but I would plant that whole pasture in sunflower and buckwheat. 
and that would put on some of the best honey, and it put on honey quick too. Yeah. Because and there was a whole pasture full of sunflower. But now we do the muscadines, so we don't do all that no more. Yeah, we got that. Hey, we got here. clover out there for Mason, them. Mason, come here. We, I wouldn't say it's just for um, the bees, because the clover's for the deer. It helps everything. Um, the garden, the fruit trees. So we plant everything kind of just to help. Them. Yes, sir. The shape of the is a hexagon. Correct. Seven jars of honey, four yeah. gallons, two quarts. Count. I wish four gallons. I'm trying to remember how much a gallon weighs. I don't remember. But it's definitely not that five gallon bucket. 25 jars. I'm hoping some of y'all's uh, predictions are correct. Good night, everyone. Thank you guys for showing all that goodness. Oh, you're signing off? Lila is. No. Oh, sorry. I was reading a comment. My bad. I know you guys are. Have fun. Thank we'll you for tuning in. We'll be Monday night. Don't forget. He will be. I'll yeah, be at work. Monday night. Bye. Bye. You say bye, Lila. Say bye. Say bye. Not, we're not leaving. We're not leaving. Right. Just Lila's. Are we running it back there? You see how that strained that out? That did real good. Let me let me lick the bottom. Okay. Mm -hmm. That did pretty good. That really didn't have a lot of trash in it. Hey, James, run. Yeah, no, there's really not a lot, have a lot of trash in it. I would not do that. You're gonna drip all over your floor. Really happy about that. Uh, we're staying here for one more minute or a little bit more. We're going to show you guys this. We're going to do the cut coming oh, live real quick. Your hands. Right. Need to hold oh, here, pick it up. Oh, no. we got the ejector. Yeah. So we run it back through in here just so that we can strain it one more time to kind of just get. There's a little random debris. It'll be bug legs. Yeah, little, little pieces of beaten wax. Yeah. Little wax in there, too. What, baby? And so we try to come here, stick your finger right there. Whoop. That's good, Emma. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> All right, ready, so. ready, go. Oh. <laughs> well, wash your hands, girl. But yeah, so that's that. Because we, we nobody may, wants. We may get 10 jars out of that, we, if, if that. Yeah, nobody wants bug parts in their honey, though. Yeah, we may get 10 jars. Probably fine, but maybe eight. No, no, do not no, open that. Because there's no bucket, bucket under underneath. There's no bucket under, but we'll lose it all. And I do not want that touching the floor. What's wrong, pal? Are you getting more honey? Yeah, we're running yeah, it here, back right here. Stick your finger in there. Stick your finger in there. Yeah, no bugs. Right here, right. Is everyone having a good weekend? Put it in your mouth real quick. They don't know how picky. There you go. You know how to do it. All right, watch out. Paula, why is Kyle going to get a black eye? By the way, just curious because I know that's from earlier. Get it, Jack. It's still hard. It's hard. It needs to be heated up. Yeah, from the last time. You have my phone. What you got? Oh, I don't blame you. It got, I don't want to say cold because there's people up north and all that. Um, yeah, it, it got, was it like 50 the past two nights? So. Can't leave them stove lights on. That's pretty fun cutting down a tree. What's up, man? 2 a.m. and up. Oh, she's talking. So far, except two of our daughters. Oh, that sucks. Hopefully, they'll, it'll be not a problem. I've had a couple of people that have had it, and they've all bounced back really easy and quick. So hopefully that's your case, Brenda. It's raining here, so I'm guessing Jesus. Oh, you're California, right? We need to take this out so I can get all this out and I scrape it. I go get a oh, scraper. Oh, yeah. Well, we got... No, we got... Oh, that's what I was looking for. Go get yeah. it. That's what I was going to look at. Yeah, we also use this to... Oh, crud. Um, sorry, I'll catch back in comments real quick. It's raining. Yes, that's good. Great weekend. First relaxed weekend. As I was going to say, hopefully you're feeling better, too. I may have to cover my garden. Dang. Is that... Yeah. Okay. Okay. Why did I think? Okay, you're south. Hey, yeah, I was driving through there yesterday and it was raining or drizzling, still freezing. I'm sorry, I forgot where you're at, Jesus Lord. Who is it that is? Is it no Kaleidoscopes, Georgia? Yeah. Who? Bug one. Huh? Crazy critter later. Crazy That's California. California. Yep. Sorry, getting them all confused. So the cool thing with having this is when we pull, like, we're gonna pull this out. We put it right there. So that, that, where'd that boat go? Yeah, it's in there. Yeah, I just dropped it in the bottom, I think. 
had to be. Yeah, yeah I, I see it. <laughs> Good thing. I dropped 38 it. in Oklahoma. That is gross. That like is I crazy. said, when we say cold, yeah. Emma, you got to take that upstairs, baby girl. Go upstairs, guys. Y'all go upstairs with that. Jack Jack, no. Jack Jack is not happy. He's very wanting to be into this and all around. <laughs> I try to remember. I'm, I I can't remember where he fed us from now. Netherlands, maybe? Try my best, and it doesn't help. I haven't been on here in two months, at least. Border, Missouri. Southwest Missouri. Yeah, I, I'm not a... Hey, I got it right. Sweet. All right. Those are 40s. Milton, Georgia. Next. Who's in Milton, Georgia? Willis Docker. Oh, that's right. Yeah, Willis is. Where's Milton? I have no idea. No. No, we're <laughs> freezing us. Yeah, I... It's in there, left side. You can. I need to heal my teeters. Yeah, I don't think there'll be much. Look at the bottom later. I think we ate most of it. It ain't like we had a lot. While he's doing that, I'm going to show... We're going to try this <laughs> cut comb for the first time. I haven't watched videos on this in forever. Probably three years. I don't remember. So let's see. Milton is north of Atlanta, 40 miles. Okay, so that's... I'm trying to remember what's... Uh, yeah. I used to drive through that area. Ooh, let's see. Let's see if that works. Just got to tighten that up. Sorry, just bear with me while I... Yeah, I'm going to try. We'll see how this works. And trying to set up the camera so everyone can kind of see what we're doing. Put a tray underneath it. Let's see. I guess it, the question would be is Milton off of 85 or 75? All right. Bear with me. I'm trying to get you guys in the camera. All right, that's going to be the best I think I can do. That's pretty good. Alpharetta. Okay. All right. So, pretty easy. We need like a measuring thing, but we're going to wing it. Yeah. Figure out the side. I need to see what kind of jars we got. These two different sides. Oh, no, I, was, I wanted to show them. This is the one we're putting honey, the comb, and this one we're not. Yeah. Just run down it. And I'll get back to comments in a second. Yeah, this is something we've never done before cut comb. So we're still learning it. out a little bit boom there's a little bit right there we can eat and stuff you definitely want that tray because i don't know if you guys can see it is pouring out on the top and then these will take that frame and build brand new comb and everything right off that i go small let's see that's gonna be beautiful isn't that neat Oh, yeah. All right, let's test this out. I'm going gonna... to have to shorten it down, I think. No. Boom. Look at that. And we'll fill it up with honey. Beautiful. And I had it. That's yeah. awesome, man. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I like it. We'll fill it full of honey. That is awesome. And like I said, if we don't have enough honey, we'll just keep them in there. All right, and these won't go bad either. Go bad. Honey does not go bad, so I want to do, do like, let's see. Yeah, that's perfect. So, use that one as my measurement. Let's double check and make sure that measurement worked. Oh, I should go a little more narrow. Okay. Boom. Thank you. I'm glad. Look it's looking good. I'll go in a little bit. 
It's funny because certain people absolutely love the having the wax. I just want straight honey. But to each is their own and everyone loves it. So, or certain people do. I've had a, many people ask for it and we've never had it. Sorry, I'm trying to cut this. My hands are sticky, so I can't read you the comments. That should be your jar, Paula, since it's the experimental one. Oh, I know for being our. There's that's our, that's There's that's Paul. yours. <laughs> we'll send that in an envelope today. It's coming your way. <laughs> that's hilarious. Paul, we're going to send you some. You guarantee that. You've helped us out so much, it's ridiculous. We're going to make sure we send Paula. So we just, yeah. Let's wrap it up. We may send it to her on the way she wants us to stop by. We may have to make sure. Perfect. I might need to actually shorten them a little bit just so that um, it'll close up. But if you wanted to get, I guess you'd break it up. If you wanted to get it out, you'd have to get a spoonful of wax too with mm -hmm. it. But that's that'd awesome. probably be fine. I bet that make your honey go a lot farther too. Because mm -hmm. you won't have as much to fill up. Well, that rag is all wet, but that's fine. Yeah, We're almost jars. gone. One, one to one Sorry, you guys don't want to see my belly. Let me fix that. Man, it's I'm trying to wash my hands off. Like Mason said, I'm all sugared up. <laughs> can you, you eat the comb? You uh, yeah, I got more jars in the state. Yeah, you can eat it. I actually never spit mine out. I shoot it. I don't. I mean, it'll break down in your stomach. I don't know if there's any health benefits to it, but if you don't feel like spitting it out or whatever, I imagine for people with braces, it's got to be good. I don't know. Never had them, but I feel like it would because you could put wax on your braces or teeth, whatever, naturally the combs afterwards. So the ones in this box right here, Michelle, we will take out, let them clean it. And then if we have a, a, a hive that needs new box or new frames, we drop it right on there. And since we didn't scrape it, um, cause some people will like, there's cheaper ways to do it than having an extractor, but you risk the comb cause they take the comb and just scrape it all off and then like kind of mash it and get all the honey out. Or if you do it this way, then the bees have to build it all out again. So I, when I did this, I only did, I think, 10 frames so that they'd have, not to build all of them out, they just had 10 that were, like, completely bare. But I did a start with a little piece of wax. So why do you leave one frame alone? Oh, we left more than just one. We left a bunch out there for them. Because um, some had brood in it for babies. And then we just always leave some, and there's plenty of time that they can get it. Let's see. I do not know, Jesus Lord, if you're asking me where, who Stacy is. Hands from the dirt, yeah. All right, let me go back to the bottom. Da, 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 da. Yeah, we left a lot. Just about everything I can get out of can you eat? Yes, we can eat it. Yeah, and uh, Paul Paul's channel will be, his live will be up eventually. Yes, yeah, we went and did a live, uh, stealing all the honey from the hives earlier. Yeah, you did? Yeah. And you're moving this out of the way. Mm -hmm. But it's all done, so it's perfect timing. Let's say we could do one jar or whatever. Show you guys that. This will be fun to fill this up with it because we've never done that either. To see how it fills up with the honey. Any other fun questions? How's it? I know we asked again. How's everyone doing? We absolutely are loving eating the honey. This is strained, man. This yeah. is ready to go. I'll show you guys. This is ready to go. How heavy oh, do you think man. it is? Maybe seven pounds, eight pounds. We got seven, eight jars. That's your jar. Oh, you know what I need to do? I need to get a tiny piece of cut comb and put it in. That, you got that one little sliver. Yeah, yeah. And put it in a our in a keeping jar. jar. Yeah, yeah. That, that sliver. Yeah. Right? Or you got all those. Yeah. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. 
I'm going to say, I'd go real slow oh, sometimes. I am. Not that <laughs> I am. So this has been filtered twice. We, we really it. don't, you don't have to filter it, but we just. But look how clean, get a close up. Look how clean that honey looks when you filter it. There's no wax in it. There's no bee parts in it. There's no trash. Look at that thing filling up just as pretty. And normally we go a little faster when there's not yeah, any. I just don't, um, I don't know how fast it's going to fill up with that comb in there. Will said he's waiting on his jar. Thanks in advance. I got to get more into beekeeping. Everyone wants a jar, yeah, right? Yeah, we're going to try to get more into it. Travis is just busy in his house. I've been all about the muscadines. Now that the muscadines are done, now we're stuck on wanting to do pigs full time. So it's is it just, filling up you know on both it sides? It's just always something. I know it's not filling up on this left and right side. The front and yeah. back is filling up. We'll probably have to go back and fill that jar up slowly. Mm -hmm. Let it all settle in. Opened up. It'll settle down naturally. Yeah, it'll settle down here in a second. Once you get on the property, you'll be able to trust. Oh, I know that's the hopes. And Travis yeah. has got a lot of land. We put hives all over the place. Let's see. See, it's not filling up. Back here. I say we got to get that comb in the back. I was gonna say, oh, honey's good started. every day. I need to move it around. To that's have. To Thank you, Veta. I got a post. I got two videos. Um of the house stuff that happened. One was this week. I'll tell you guys about it. Um, yeah, there'll be a little bit for him left after that kaleidoscope junkie. Um, we got my, the basement poured and the deck, the back deck poured. Um, so <laughs> I'm excited. I'm real excited about the house. Looks and like I got video that. for it. I just, that looks like you buy it from I Kroger. To it. That's Kroger, honey, right there, son. Look at that. Boom, perfect. We look like professionals, pal. We look like we know what we're doing, don't we? I am so happy. <laughs> so we look like we know what we're doing. Look at that, dude. That's awesome. Y'all got to see from there start to finish how it's done. Yeah. And you, then you just, you don't have to heat treat it or nothing. Just put a cap on it. That's it. Boom. Yeah. Nice, pretty jar of honey. There's yours, Paula. There you go. Paula, you go know. You're going to get one. You, you helped me out so much, you just don't know. We'd already planned on giving you one. Thank you, Brenda. It is a lot of fun, very rewarding. Um, if we stayed on them and get them going real good this before fall, we could get a lot more. The first year, I'm trying to think, I think we got like 30 jars or more, 30, 40, maybe 50. I don't know. It's a lot. It's really cool. Um, I stacked them up on the table. It was real fun. I'll show you. Do we want to do one of these ones real quick? Yeah, we can. You got one that fit in there? No, I wasn't going to do wax in it. Oh, just full comb, yeah. Yeah, full. I mean, full honey, yeah. Yeah. Let's see, without um, comb in there, it's a lot easier, faster to fill up. <laughs> There's little wads of wax all over the place. Little wads of wax between me and the kids. That was fun. Mm. I'm happy as can be about that. Happy as can be. Beautiful. Nice, quick, and easy to fill it without wax, but be cool to have it with the wax. Thank you guys for everyone hanging out with us. Yeah, that was no fun. Doubt. How many people get to watch them? Uh, 15 yeah, right now. It's good. been up and down. Y'all see the all one in on, May? That, you just take that. Just take it. Bite out of that. Look at that. That's insane. I need to go get a jar from a nano. I love to cut comb. Yeah. <laughs> so we're probably going to hop off. It's been like an yeah, we're we're right at an hour. But thank you guys for hanging out. That Does anyone fun. have questions real quick before we jump off? Give you like 30, 40 seconds. Glad you enjoyed it, Lori, or it's been interesting for you. And if you did not see Shane's live um, when we were pulling the frames and checking the bees real quick, definitely check that out. Kenpo Farmer, Georgia. Yep, Kenpo Farmer. Paula's put up links. She'll probably drop one again. Appreciate it again, Paula. Paula, we'll make sure we get some. We're still on the. Uh, we're still not sure about stopping or not. We got to look at our route. I know we keep saying you want us to stop by there. I know that. We got to look at our route first. We'll see if our route brings us close by or something. If so, we'll we'll pull through. Uh, either coming or going, but we we definitely got one with your name on. Love it. being you, here you, again, Abetta. You bet your butt on that. Did I ever write you back? I'm sorry if we didn't or just didn't. 
I know you messaged us, seeing how we're doing. Yeah, Paul, you've helped us out so much. You know, you know that. I already told you I owe you for helping me with Darren's live. Not at the meetup, um, and we probably won't sell this one just because we don't have enough. Mm -hmm. um, we'll try to give it what I mean. We put it back for us, and then whatever extra we have, we try to share. But this, with only being seven eight jars, won't be a lot. You got to remember, we got family. <laughs> we got family. We got mommies. That want it too. My mama, his mom, everybody wants Siblings. it. Every, every, this is liquid gold. Everybody wants it. Mm -hmm. so, and, and our beekeeping has just went way down since I've been, like I say, I've been doing the muscle down. He's building a house. It's just gone way down. We haven't hardly been fooling. It's just, we're keeping them alive and that's basically it. Yep. So yeah, next year, hopefully I'll be born we'll to it harder, but yeah. we're trying to keep them through this year. So yeah. we'll see you guys. Thank you again. <laughs> Check his live. That happened today. Yeah. And Monday he'll be going live again. See you guys. Have a great day. Thanks. Great weekend. Enjoy Appreciate yourself. It. Thank y'all. <laughs> uh, yes. Fun. Good night.